I swear to God, sobrang generous nila. Nagbibigay talaga sila ng mga pa-PR. And that case, I received the product straight from Korea to my house without spending any amount. Umuulan dito ngayon, as in sobrang ingay, that's why hinawakan ko na talaga ng super lapit sa bibig ko yung mic para marinig nyo ko. Ayan, so what is up you guys? It's your girl Maya. We're back again with another YouTube video. And for today's video, as you guys can see from the title down below, pag-uusapan natin ang tatlong paraan para makakuha ng free products. So, alam ko naman na maraming paraan para makakuha ng free products, pero sa video na ito, tatlo lang ang pag-uusapan natin. First in line is ang pagsali sa mga giveaways. So, ano bang makukuha mo sa pag-join sa mga giveaways? Maraming kasing types of giveaways. We have a makeup giveaway, skincare giveaway, stationery giveaway, cash giveaway, and meron ding mga phone giveaways and other gadget giveaways. So, depende yan sa anong gusto ipag-giveaway ng host. Saan mo makahanap ang mga giveaways na ito? Meron nito sa YouTube, meron sa Instagram, meron sa Facebook, and even sa TikTok and other social media platforms, merong mga giveaways. Now, paano nga ba maghanap ng giveaways? So, ang ginagawa ko personally is, uh, hindi ako masyadong nadjo-join sa mga giveaways sa Instagram and Facebook. Ang usually na pinaghahanapan ko ng giveaways dito sa YouTube. So, ang ginagawa ko is, sa search bar, punta ka sa search bar, tapos i-search mo giveaway. Pwede yung makeup giveaway, skincare giveaway, depende sa kung anong gusto mong salian or mapanalunan. And then, ang gawin mo is, is i-click mo yung um, filter. After clicking the filter, you're going to click the upload date. Bakit? Kasi that way, ang lalabas ng mga results is yung mga sets of giveaways na most recent. Yung pwede mo pang masalihan. Pwede ka ding mag-search sa Facebook and sa Instagram and even sa TikTok. So, depende na din yan sa discarte mo para makahanap ng giveaway. Now, paano ka nga ba mananalo sa pag-join sa mga giveaways? So, very first na kailangan mong gawin is you have to follow all the mechanics. Strictly follow all the mechanics. Make sure na wala kang na-miss ni isa sa mga mechanics na in-include in ng host. Bakit? Kasi, chine-check nila yan and... Possibility is kapag ka may isa o dalawa na hindi ka na-follow dun sa mga mechanics na pinurvide ng host and napili ka as winner pero hindi mo pala finalo, ang mangyayari kasi nun is magiging null yung, yung pagkapanalo mo. Hindi siya magiging valid. So, dapat talaga strictly follow all the mechanics of the giveaway. Next thing you have to consider as well is Kapag ka ang isang host nagsabi na bonus points kapag ka gagawin nyo to, gawin mo yon para may bonus points ka. Kasi, ibig sabihin nun, pag may bonus points ka, you have more chances of winning. So, kahit, kahit madami yung mga sumali, at least, di ba, meron kang extra points. And take note lang na kapag kasasali ka sa giveaway and ayaw mong gumastos, dapat you have to make sure na ang magbabayad ng shipping fee is yung host mismo. Kasi may mga nagpapag-giveaway na yung mananalo ang mag-shoulder ng shipping fee. Which is, ayaw mo naman siguro ang gumastos, di ba? Kasi nga gusto mo free lang yung maku free mo lang makuha yung mga products. So, ang gawin mo is, you have to make sure na yung sinasalihan mong giveaway is, yung host ang magsushoulder ng shipping fee para wala kang bayaran kahit ni isang kosing. Kung sa mechanics is, you have to tag as many friends as you can, then tag as many friends as you can. Kung comment down below why you deserve to win, then you have to explain why you deserve to win. Kung anong may tutulong ng product sa'yo, kung... Um, how important is it for you to win? Or, ano pa ba? Um, bakit deserving kang manalo? You have to explain para ma-capture mo yung attention ng nag-host and greater possibility of you winning. Now, I am actually talking from experience because I actually joined a lot of giveaways nung nag-start yung quarantine. Kasi dati, hindi ako naniniwala sa mga giveaways kasi iniisip ko, ay baka dinadaya lang tapos wala namang mananalo. Alam mo yung ganun. But then again, I realized, totoo pala yung mga giveaways, lalo na dito sa YouTube. So, ang ginawa ko ay sumali ako, ang dami kong sinalihan. And then, month of November, I was able to win. That was the very first time na nanalo ako sa isang giveaway. And it was actually Miss Ariel Hernandez's um, giveaway, which is the Dear Self Beauty product. So, ayun, ako yung naging grand winner. And then after nun, parang naalik na ako sa pag-join sa mga giveaways. So, ang ginawa ko is, lagi na akong naghahanap ng mga giveaways, nililista ko. And importante kasi na ilista mo yung date of announcement para present ka by the time na ina-announce yung winner. 
that way, madali mong malaman kung nanalo ka o hindi. Ganun. And then, by month of December, ayun, sali pa rin ako ng sali. And I was able to win another giveaway, which is yung giveaway ni Miss Tara. Her channel is actually Truly Tara on um, YouTube. So, ayun, nanalo naman ako ng mga cosmetics ulit, which is the Mino Cosmetics, yung isang whole, yung whole set ng mga products nila. And then, by January, I was also able to win again another giveaway, which is yung kay Miss Pau Bautista which is Beauty Basics on Instagram. So, ang napanalunan ko sa kanya is like a thousand worth of Strokes Beauty Lab products. And by the way, lahat ng mga products na panalunan ko sa mga giveaways sa sinalihan ko is ginawan ko ng review video. Kaya kung interested kayong panuorin, you may go check my channel for those videos. And speaking of giveaway, um, abang-abang lang kayo sa channel ko because we will be having a Road to 2K giveaway. Very, very soon. Ayan. So, stay tuned. So, tapos na natin pag-usapan yung giveaway, which is sa pinakaunong paraan para makakuha ng free products. Ngayon naman, pag-usapan natin ang ikalawang paraan para makakuha ng mga free products. And ang tinutukoy ko dito ay ang uh, PR packages or brand collabs. Now, ano nga ba ang PR packages and brand collabs? Ang ibig sabihin ng PR packages or brand collabs is... um. Isang brand, may it be big, small, local, or international, is magpo-provide sila ng free products sa'yo. Pwedeng isang set ng products nila or pwedeng lahat ng products nila i-give nila sa'yo for free. And in exchange to that is you're gonna give an honest review about their products. So aside dun sa fact na makakatanggap ka talaga ng free products from that specific brand, you'll also going to have an agreement. So ang agreement nyo is nakadepende sa kung ano yung usapan ninyong dalawa. So pwedeng um, mag-review ka lang ng products sa Facebook or pwedeng mag-review ka ng product um, sa Instagram lang or sa IG story lang or pwede talagang gawan mo ng video dito sa YouTube depende yan sa magiging agreement ninyo ng brand na magpo-provide sa'yo ng product So, paano nga ba sumali sa mga brand collab or makatanggap ng PR packages? Minsan is ang brand mismo ang mag a approach sa'yo pwedeng i-email ka nila or i-DM ka nila sa Instagram, Facebook or you know, depende kung saan kanila nila pwedeng ma-reach out so, pwedeng i-approach ka nila and then sabihin nila sa'yo na interested ka ba na maging uh, na makipag-golab sa amin? Kasi ganto kasi ganto So, depende na din yan sa way of approaching nila. Usually, ang mga ina-approach ng mga brands is yung mga may um, maraming subscribers sa YouTube, maraming followers sa Instagram, maraming likes sa Facebook. Ganon usually yung mga approach ng mga brand. Okay? So, paano naman tayong mga konti lang yung subscribers and followers and likes? Madali lang din yan. Pwedeng tayo ang mag-approach sa kanila. So, when approaching them, you have to advertise yourself. You have to tell them anong maitutulong mo sa brand nila. You have to tell them um anong kaya mong gawin for them. How are you gonna help them, you know, get more um, buyers, have higher rate of sale. Depende sa iyo yan kung paano mo i-discard or i-advertise yung sarili mo para makonvince sila that you will be helpful for their brand. Pero meron naman ding mga brands na naghihintay lang talaga sila na i-approach sila. So, hindi sila after sa number of subscribers, number of followers, or number of likes. Ang sa kanila lang is kung sino yung interesado na i-review yung products nila. Kung sino yung may interest talaga sa products nila, yun yung kukunin nila for peer packages. Take note, meron ding mga brands, especially mga international brands. Mga Korean brands, ganon. Meron ding mga ganong brands na sila mismo yung nagpo-post na we are looking for reviewers. Ganto, we are looking for 150 reviewers of the Everyday Basics, ganon-ganon. So, meron ding mga ganong brands that they are really the one who reach out to people. So, ang gagawin mo lang is, kiklik mo yung link and then mag a ka, fill out mo yung form, especially yung kung saan i ipapadali yung package, and then... Maghintay ka na mag-announce sila because most of which siguro nagtatagal ng mga a month and then ayun kung nakuha ka, kung nag-email sila nakukuha ka so it means makakatanggap ka talaga ng free products, ganun lang din and in exchange of course you have to give your honest review. May it be in the form of a YouTube video, a Facebook post, an IGTV post whatever, depende sa agreement. Okay, take note, hindi mo kailangang magsinungaling na, oh, sobrang ganda ng brand, sobrang ganda, ganda-ganda ako, gusto gusto ko, kasi ang ganda talaga. No need ganun ha, because ang na-expect nila from you is actually an honest review. That way kasi, mapapa better pa nila yung product nila. Okay, so no need na magsinungaling just because you got free products. Take note then na may mga brand collabs actually na merong mga incentives. 
pwedeng bibigyan kanila ng more products, pwedeng bibigyan kanila ng another set of products para may giveaway mo sa mga viewers mo, pwede rin bigyan kanila ng contracts, and meron ding iba na nagbibigay ng cash. So again, I am talking from experience because I was also able to do a brand collab with an international brand called Jumiso, and they actually sent me their PR package. So, konting story time lang. I don't know if you guys are familiar with Style Korean Global. So, I suggest that you follow them on Instagram because every month yata nagkakaroon sila ng viewer hunt. So, you have to follow them on Instagram or you can visit their um, website. Ilalagay ko na lang sa description box below. So, ang nangyari kasi nun is nakakita ko ng IG post na try me, review me and then Ayun, yung Try Me Review Me is program yun ng Style Korean Global wherein magko-collaborate ang isang brand at yung mga um, influencers. So, sa case ko, nakuha nila akong bilang reviewer and then pinadalhan nila ako ng whole set ng Jumiso All Day Vitamin um, Kit. Ginawa ko dun is nag-fill up lang ako ng kung saan dapat i-address yung package and then yung number of subscribers, name, yung mga essential things that you have to uh, fill in para makakuha ka nung products nila. And then, a week after yata, ayun, I was able to receive an email from them that uh, I was I was one of the lucky reviewers. So, ayun, they sent me the product and then ginawan ko ng review video. And then, pinost ko din yun sa channel ko actually. So, ayan. ayan. If you're also interested to view that video, I'll be putting the link down below sa description box and you may also go check my channel. You have to take note lang that whenever you're going to you, you're gonna join a brand collabs and you're gonna be receiving peer packages, dapat maging responsible sa paggawa ng review. Hindi yung nakatambak na yung mga products na tanggap ng tanggap ka lang tapos hindi mo nagagawa ng review. Huwag ganun. Kasi nagre-rely din yung brand na yon sa iyo. Naghihintay din sila na may ma-content din sila. Kasi usually yung mga reviews na binibigay mo comes with pictures, comes with videos. Ginagamit din nila yun uh, para sa mga, you know, social media posts nila. So, nagre-rely din sila sa iyo. Kaya dapat maging responsible ka. And isa pa sa i-add ko is that ang mga pinaka-generous na mga brands are actually mga international brands. Like those from Korea. I swear to God, sobrang generous nila. Nagbibigay talaga sila ng mga pa-PR. And that case, I received the product straight from Korea to my house without spending any amount. Moving on naman sa third way or sa ikatlong paraan para makakuha ng free products is ang pagsali sa mga BA search or mga brand ambassador search. So itong mga BA search or brand ambassador search na binabanggit ko is actually meron din ito sa YouTube, meron pa din sa Facebook, meron sa Instagram at sa TikTok at sa iba pang mga social media platforms. Usually, um, kapag ka ang isang brand is kakalo launch pa lang, merong chances na magpa-BA search sila. And yung iba naman is kahit um, well-established brands na sila sa Instagram, sa Facebook, uh, they still do BA searches. By batch yan. Let's say for example, for the month of May to July, they will be having a set of brand ambassadors. And then the following months, ibang brand ambassadors naman. So ayan, depende yan sa brand. So usually, pwede mo namang i-search, lalo na sa Instagram talaga. Super, super dominant ito sa Instagram. So you just have to search BA search or ongoing BA search or brand ambassador search. So lalabas na rin yung mga brand. Kasi usually sa mga brand sa Instagram, kapag ka nagpa-BA search sila, is nilalagay nila sa bio nila. So that whenever you search the term, lalabas din yung page nila. Now, paano nga ba sumali sa mga brand ambassador search? So, depende din ulit yan sa brand. Yung iba is parang maipapalike lang sila na picture and then pa-follow mo yung account nila and then comment down below something else, ganun. Yung iba naman is kailangan mo talagang personally na mag-purchase ng item from them. Usually, ginagawa to ng mga small brands, yung uh, kailangan mo talagang mag-purchase ng item from them. Let's say, for example, uh, minimum of 300 pesos. And then once nag-purchase ka sa kanila ng minimum of 300 pesos, you're automatically their brand ambassador. Ganun usually. But yung iba, hindi naman kailangan ng purchase. Meron lang silang mga mechanics palang sa giveaway lang din. Like, you have to share the post to your Instagram story or to your, you know, to your newsfeed. Depende na din yan sa kanila. 
<laughs> and since our video is about getting free products without spending money from your pocket, so hindi natin eco consider eh, hindi tayo mag-focus dun sa purchase purchase thingy. So, ano nga ba ang isang BA? Ang isang BA or brand ambassador is para lang din yung influencer. Though, sabihin man nilang magkaiba ang brand ambassador and brand influencer, magkakapareho pa rin yun. There's just a thin line between those two terminologies. In the simplest form, pwede nating sabihin na kapag ka BA ka ng isang brand, of if you're the brand ambassador, it means that you're mostly like the face of that brand. Yes, face of that brand. But not literally na yung mukha mo talaga yung ididikit nila sa packaging. Hindi ganun. What I mean with that face of the brand quotation is that um, they're gonna send you the product and then you're gonna use it. Let's say for example, they're gonna send you a lip tint and then you're gonna use it on your lips. You're gonna take a photo of yourself and then post it on your Instagram and then pwede nilang gamitin yung photo mo na isi-share din nila dun sa mga social media accounts nila. So, yung ibang brand ambassador search is actually meron silang mga palang threshold or like, kailangan ito yung number of subscribers mo or ito yung number of followers and likes mo. That is of course for them to make sure na malawak talaga yung audience na maaabot nung uh, products nila once they send it to you, ba? Diba? But good thing is, hindi naman lahat because meron pa din namang mga kind and considerate brands na hindi sila nagmag-matter sa number of subscribers or sa number of followers mo. So, yeah. You just have to search for the right brand for you. And, huwag kang basta-basta lang sasali sa isang brand ambassador search dahil lang gusto mo ng free products. Kasi, it comes with a responsibility. Hindi kasi yan one time lang na kapag ka natanggap mo, ginamit mo, magsasend ka ng picture. No. Ang trabaho ng isang brand ambassador is you have to help that specific brand na ine-endorse mo na makakuha ng mas maraming buyers, na makakuha ng mas mataas na purchase rate. Alam mo yung ganun, you have to spread the word about that specific brand to your friends, to your viewers. You're going to influence people to buy from that specific brand. So, ganun pa din. Dito pa din sa brand ambassador searches na sasalihan mo, magbibigay pa din sila sa iyo ng um, promo codes. And kapag ka nagamit yun, according to your agreement, like say for example, twice or thrice, makakakuha ka ulit ng PR packages from them. And isa pa sa napansin ko, kapag ka isa kang BA ng isang brand, dapat active ka talaga sa lahat ng social media products mo. Let's say for example, ang isang specific brand is mostly prominent sa Instagram. So dapat active ka lagi sa Instagram. Dapat palagi mong sinishare yung mga posts nila. Sa Instagram stories mo, dapat palagi kang nagre-react sa mga posts nila. That way kasi is you are actually engaging with the brand you are having a collab with. Okay, so... Since ikaw naman yung brand ambassador ng brand na yan, marapat lang din siguro no, na gawin mo yung trabaho mo para tulungan sila. Because that is in exchange to the free products that they sent you. This is again based on experience. I was also able to become a brand ambassador of a specific local brand. It's actually um, Skinworthy PH. So they are a cosmetic brand and they sell um, rejuvenating sets. So, doon naman sa case ko sa Skinworthy, ang nangyari is naghahanap sila ng mga ambassadors. So, nag-apply ako and then I got a DM from them that I was one of the lucky brand ambassadors kasi 10 lang yata yung uh, hinahanap nila. So, ayun, gumawa ako ng uh, unboxing video, review video sa channel ko. So, ayun, and then I also posted a photo of me holding their products sa Instagram. Basta depende na din yun sa agreement namin. Ang tawag sa mga brand ambassador ng Skinworthy PH is Skin Ambassador. So, ayun, alagang Skinworthy PH. So, ilan lang yung mga nabanggit ko sa mga ways para makakuha ng free products. So, ayan, if may alam pa kayong iba, please comment down below para malaman din namin. And I hope that you learned something from this video. So, ayan, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please click the subscribe button and the notification bell so that you get the latest updates from my latest videos. And of course, comment yun na din kung anong mga videos na gusto nyo makita dito sa channel ko. Ayan. So, that is all. See you in my next video. Bye!